Several years ago, a Henderson County school began something important but simple. Actually, the principal says it's invaluable. Our person of the week plays a unique role, and the children will tell you he can make the difference in a bad day or a good day. Before school begins, good morning. Before the parking lot's full and things get busy, he's waiting. Good morning. Mr. Ken, they call him. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Glenn Marlowe Elementary's morning man. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. For each and every child getting off the bus, good morning. Ken Seal has agreed. No, you'd like to hear it. Good morning. A helping hand. Bus after bus, year after year. For four years and every school day. Good morning. Except when he's sick. Good morning, Miss Emma. And he went boom right oh, into a bowl. Oh, gee. Right into a bowl. He's right listened right to right their right stories. Right. Oh. <laughs> Returned a hug. See you at the cafeteria. I know that he's going to greet you, whether it's a bad day, rainy day, sad day, happy day. He is the constant for every child and, and the start of their school day. When Ken Seal retired. Have a great day. You never imagined he would set the tone for children each school day. Have a great day. Strange that I would be at a school doing something like this, uh, volunteering like that, because I didn't really appreciate school when I was growing up. It's just one hour a day. You have a great day today. Why, thank you. See you tomorrow. They just are so used to his presence. It's a comforting presence. It's one in which um, our students look forward to it and our staff look forward to it. It helps me a lot. You have a great day today, okay? Mm. Shows somebody cares for him like that and somebody willing to listen to him if they want to say something. If school is a place of learning, what Mr. Ken has been teaching is timeless. Have a great day. With a little time and a few kind words. That first smile, that, that enthusiasm, that somebody who knows your name. It makes a difference. That's why I'm still here. Have a great day. Thank you. Why, thank you. See you tomorrow. A lesson in kindness. Have a great day. Worth keeping. That would be it. By the way, for those who might wonder about the hugs, Ken says the only time he's allowed to hug a child is if the child initiates the hug. If you know someone who's making a difference in the community, someone who inspires others, tell me about them in an email. Send it to news at WLOS.com and do not forget those phone numbers.